Hey everyone, welcome back to another quick how-to. In this video, we're going to show you how you can start Timu drop shipping on Shopify. So the first step here that we can do is basically go to the Buy Store on your Shopify and sign in with your account. And here, if you're going to click on the search icon, the search box at the top and search for Timu, we're now go here on Shopify App Store. Now you'll be taken into this page where you can find all the apps that is available but unfortunately we don't have Timu app right here. So what are we going to do here is we're going to select this Auto DS Dropshipping and POD. So we're going to install this app to your Shopify store. Okay. So as you can see from $26.90 a month so we have here 14 day free trial. So you can start uh, try this application. So what you're going to do is basically just have to install this app. And then once you install this to your Shopify store, then open the app and you'll be directly go to AutoDS. So basically, if you don't have an account yet, you just have to sign up with your account, maybe your Google account. And once you signed in, now you'll be directly go to this dashboard. So it will show you that it is connected to your store. So once it connected, the next step that we're going to do is go to the settings at the bottom left hand corner of your screen. And then we're going to click on add supplier. And then select supplier and you just have to find Simu. So basically, I just already added this supplier right here. Now the next step here that we can do to find product is by going to this add products button. So here you have four options if you want single product, multiple products or stores, handpick products or other DS finder. In this case, I'm going to select single product. And then you can basically enter or just paste the URL link right here. So go to Timu and find a product that you want to sell using the other DS. Okay, so for example, I'm going to select the shoe glue right here. So I want to sell this multi-purpose 60ml shoe and plastic glue, strong band, quick repair for home or outdoor. Alright, so if you're going to copy the link right here, so right click and then click on copy, go back to AutoDS, right, and paste it right here. So once you've done that, usually the supplier source right here is automatically changed into Timu, but unfortunately, Timu doesn't support AutoDS. So, how can we sell that product from Timu to your Shopify store? So, the only way that we can do right here, so as you can see, it will show you this like error. So, what we can do right here is we're going to use the AliExpress Azure supplier source and find product from Timu. So, how we can do that? Basically, just have to click on the Add New button or Add New tab and search for Chrome Web Store. We're going to this website. And then here on Chrome Web Store, go to search box and type here search AliExpress, right? Once you find this AliExpress search by image, you just have to click on the Add to Chrome button right there. And you just have to add it to your extension. So as you can see, I have already added this AliExpress extension and AutoDS dropshipping helper. Okay, so once done adding these two extensions here, go to Timu and find this product. To do that, right click on the image and click on AliExpress search by image. Then it will show you the results using the Google Lens. So as you can see right from here, the right side of your screen, you will find all of the e-commerce store. And then you will find the AliExpress right here. Same product from Timu. So if you're going to click on that product, then you will basically find the details. So as you can see from Timu, it's $1, but here it's, it's actually $2, $2.23. So the price is different, but the product is the same. So as you can see right here, we have some details, the same as the product from Timu. So they can actually choose the color or or how many pieces they would like to buy. So you just have to copy the link right here and then go back to AutoDS. 
and then paste the link right here on the box supplier url right and the supplier source will be automatically changed into aliexpress now you have two buttons here publish to store and edit now if you want to select publish to store basically you want it to go live your store and ready to be sold or if you want to click on edit now button you want to make necessary adjustment so i'm going to select this edit now button right here and then as you can see you'll be taken into this page where you can edit or customize the product details or descriptions so as you can see item is being added to drops and you can just customize it for example you don't want this title and you just want to change it so basically all you need to do is just have to click on this box and you can customize and edit the product title that you want for example i'm going to delete this detail and i'm going to just choose this product or add this on my product title or you can optimize title with ai so if you're going to use ai it will automatically change for example if you want to choose a tone or choose a temperature right here so you just click on ai right and there you have it so in this case i'm going to just select this uh, product title and you can change the shipping methods here if you want cheapest cheapest with tracking or fastest with tracking i'm going to select this one and also the current location is china and default city is shenzhen Okay, so once done, you can save this as draft or you can save it and import to your Shopify store. So I'm going to click on save and import. And as you can see now, it has been updated. And if you're going to click on view details right there at the top. So if you're going to click this one, as you can see the status here, it is now completed. So if you go back to your Shopify store and go to products, then you'll basically find that product right over here. So there you have it. We have the product right here, the same as the product from Tim. So you can now customize and edit the product descriptions and details. So that's it. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and see you on the next video.